up with Pat's Two Cents. I just want to ask you to please pray with me on a very important issue. I don't want to say what it is because I don't feel like being censored. I'm already under fire right now as far as my channel is concerned. They're scrutinizing everything and I want to make sure that I keep them out of the loop as much as possible. But you know what I'm talking about. Now, jab or whatever you want to call it. But the bottom line is we need to pray that God goes behind the curtains, that God gets all up under the covers, and he pulls the wool off of everything so that the powers that be, the wickedness in high places can be exposed. They need to be exposed. There are too many people being forced and coerced into doing things. Too many people being uh, convinced to make decisions that are uneducated decisions because we hear the positive. We're not getting the full picture. And there are too many professionals out there that are saying we're not getting the full picture. So what I'm asking you to do is pray. I heard a brother on uh, YouTube sharing about how there was going to be a lot of exposure and God's foot is going to come down and the covers are going to come off. Let's pray that that happens sooner than later to spare as many as possible. And our freedoms don't need to be taken away. Now, neither one of us need to be looking at each other cockeyed. If you want it or you don't want it, if I want it or don't want it, the bottom line is we have the freedom to make that choice and we should be able to make that choice freely without being threatened of losing jobs, without being bribed with money, without being coerced in any way, shape or form. This is not the mark, but it's close to it. It's getting us ready for it. It is conditioning society for that day. But remember, the mark cannot be introduced until you know who comes on the scene. Amen? And the thing the Bible says is that the restrainer, <laughs> once the, the restrainer is taken away, then the rest shall be revealed. So let's hope and pray that we're talking about the Holy Ghost because the only ones that house the Holy Ghost is you and me, those of us God's people, truly God's people. And those of us who are filled with the Holy Ghost, when the Holy Ghost goes, baby, we got to go with him. He's not going to leave us here. God bless you. Be encouraged. And remember, pray about that that the powers that be will be exposed and all this nonsense will be put to a screeching halt. <laughs>